An Amherst restaurant owner now facing more trouble in the new year after being accused of sexual harassment several months ago. As 7 Eyewitness News senior reporter Eileen Buckley shows us tonight, the owner of Protocol is now accused of withholding tens of thousands of dollars in tip money from his staff. Court documents filed in state Supreme Court by the State Labor Department say protocol owner Paul Pelzinski stopped making payments for tip appropriations. In September of 2015, he was ordered to make payments in compliance with state labor law, owing more than $97,000. But after paying about $21,000, documents say the payments stopped. And complicating the situation, the state added interest and penalties. So now he's ordered to pay over $300,000. According to court documents, the state labor commissioner says the owner of the protocol owes more than 100 servers back wages and tips, totaling thousands of dollars. Court papers say one server is owed more than $14,000, another $11,000. All the money earned working for the protocol banquet between 2011 and 2014. This is the second time the protocol owner is facing trouble from employees. Last spring, he was hit with a federal lawsuit from female employees accusing him of sexual harassment. I reached out to Plazinski about this latest situation. He was completely caught off guard, claiming he knew nothing about the court filing, stating, quote, oh, my God. Plazinski says he was fined several years ago for the banquet side of his business. He said he thought he was filing the tips correctly, but the state said otherwise, fining him. He began making payments, but stopped in June. He also tells 7 Eyewitness News he has paperwork stating he has until November of this year to complete the payments and has every intention of paying off what he owes. In Amherst, Eileen Buckley, 7 Eyewitness News.